and hello there. Uh, just doing a little quick ride down here to uh, this bullshit ass car show over here. Like it's fucking ice cold right now. But uh, it's an excuse to ride somewhere. And it looks like it's gonna rain any second. So it's not far away. But uh, after riding like a fucking animal, like you'll see in the last few videos, my body is killing me. I have um, two herniated and bulging discs in my neck and 11 in my back. And uh, yesterday took its toll on me. Ugh, really beat the shit out of me actually. I told these guys we gotta go slow and I take it easy next time because Frank's headed towards being on a road king soon. I'm gonna flush this thing out and get some better shots, that's for sure. But this is fucking crazy, man. My, my shoulder needs an operation too, so I'm falling apart. I was in a bad car accident in 1991 where the driver flew over me. The only thing that stopped him was the wall and that we bounced off of in an 85 Cougar. And uh my leg. I was seat belted in. He went flying over me. This is my friend Louis Gonzalez. He went flying over me and his feet hooked onto my leg. Like like such. Like this. You know, like they hooked onto me facing down. And uh yeah, he was um he had a broken uh, six broken necks and bones in his neck and uh, a bunch of lacerations and stuff. And I was all looked okay, but from what I found out later on in life is I really got snagged by that seatbelt. My seat was bent outside of the vehicle. It pushed the door open. So, yeah. And uh, my friend John Jimenez, who was behind me, passed away that day. His, uh, his eyes were open, but there was no response at all. He was in the back seat sitting behind me and his head was bouncing. That's all I remember. I miss you, buddy. You fucking goggler. He was a crazy bastard. Type guy, like, I was 16, he was 17, going, he, was, he was going on like 40. And uh, he would fucking like, he wouldn't fret to pull out a fucking assault rifle and start spraying that shit in the middle of the street. He was a psycho. He did a lot of bad shit too, guys. He wasn't a, uh, a saint. Just because someone dies doesn't, you know, exonerate all the bad shit they did. Even if it is a, a young person. I mean, he would have. He was the type of guy would have learned from his mistakes, though. He would have repented. But, uh, so to speak. But Johnny, Johnny Bensonhurst. He was like a really cool dude. Like, we were so young, and he was like hanging out with like middle-aged women and like hot girls. That was his thing. Always had a nice car, money, wads of money, pounds of weed, ounces of coke. Always had a lot of stuff. But what he didn't have was time. It wasn't on his side. And he was from Bensonhurst, Brooklyn. And he used to tell everybody he was Italian. He didn't tell anybody that Jimenez last name. He always said like, I forgot what it was. It was an Italian last name. But it was so lame. I knew he was Spanish. You know, close people to him knew he was Spanish, but I don't know why he was ashamed, you know, but he was Colombian. He looked Italian though, like, you know, it's hard to tell with Latin people, you know, we all, we all have that Latin look to us, you know. But uh, yeah, he was, <laughs> Something else. He was a fucking lunatic. He'd go hang out in beds and earth with his boys. They were crazy fucks. Steven Knight, Burner, Bien. They all wrote graffiti. It's Fred Fink. Yeah, his boy Fink used to write graffiti and they did an in memory piece for my friend John. And, uh, they went over some other graffiti writers. I think it was Duro and somebody 
somebody else, but they, they buffed them, is what we call it in graffiti. So they buffed them, those two wild style pieces that were there, like crazy, like intricate pieces of graffiti that were there for a few years. And um, because they did that with the memory piece, which ended up getting covered anyway, that kid Frank Fink ended up catching bullets in his head. Five bullets. I put my, he gave me my, he goes, give me your hand. He grabs my hand and I wish I didn't do this. And he put my hand on his drooping fucking side of his face. And I realized what was going on. Because I hadn't heard about the shooting. But he was alive. He was 15. We were at a, a club a warehouse party for John's memory. And it was crazy, man. Dude had no fucking skull. It was missing. It had to be fully adult size before they put the skull the, the plate in. Crazy though, I, I mean, because my friend died and we put it in memory, you know, tribute to him on the wall. Someone caught up with five bullets in the head and lived. People get shot all the time around here, guys. I, I don't, you know, if anybody's watching me out of state or living in a nice area, this isn't so bad, but all the surrounding areas within miles, people get shot and killed every day. It's a harsh fact in New York. I've lost a lot of friends. My friends I mainly lost from car accidents and uh, motorcycle accidents and a couple shootings, but... And suicide. And drug overdoses. Mainly drug overdoses. All my friends overdosed. Just lost my friend Jeremy, friend Sean. It's crazy, this fucking heroin shit. Can't fucking deal with it, don't like it. Oh, why did he call me? Told me because there's nobody there. I say. Well, since you can't use a cell phone and ride a motorcycle. I figured you were calling me to tell me everybody's gone. We're going to Frank's house. Oh, okay. Come on, we're going to go to Frank's house. Okay. Fucking <laughs> 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 thing just left. It sounds horrible. Oh, really? The exhaust is scraping the whole way down. It's destroying there. it slowly? Oh, hold it on. Don't go to scrape it. Fast. Yeah, fast. Rapidly. Unbelievable. It's too fast. Too fast. <laughs> I'll give you the stock springs and see you, bro. You can make it all work. That is funny. That's a good shirt, Cud. I like that one. Sure, bought it. That's a good one. No ticks, no noises. Good, good. Knock on wood. Good. Take it easy, my shoulder's killing me. Gotta ride like humans today. Come on, push, shorty.
I love the fucking sound of that thing, man. I love it. That's got the best sound I've ever heard. One Oh, it's none. <laughs> nice brand new ram. Oh, it is Frankie, right? I wish we got him wearing a full face. <laughs> Frankie! Talking to some chick. Probably one blowing him right now. Yeah, it's Frankie. I support vaping. I gotta raise the back end up so bad. I wanna be able to turn without hitting shit. It is. It's in the right holes. I'm in the front holes. Short shots. We beat him here. Why does your girl have Tennessee plates? Babe, move up a little <laughs> more. I just noticed that. <laughs> 